2022 was all about King Dollar ruling the world. The US currency surged to the highest in two decades last year as the Federal Reserve rapidly raised interest rates to contain surging inflation. This year, the greenback will be dethroned. Here's why. The US central bank is nearing the end of its hiking cycle on signs inflation has peaked. In their drive to slow the economy, Fed officials intend to raise benchmark rates to above 5%, which likely means another three hikes this year, after which they'll pause to assess the next move. With other countries also raising their interest rates to fight inflation, money is seen flowing to those markets in search of higher returns, weakening the dollar as a result. So where does that leave U.S. bonds and stocks? Well, treasuries could rebound from last year's record losses as the market anticipates a sluggish economy and the Fed eventually pivots to rate cuts. If the much-predicted recession hits, investors will seek the safety of high-grade debt such as U.S. bonds. The weaker dollar will give stocks some help because it boosts the value of overseas earnings. U.S. consumers also continue to surprise with their ability to spend and the job market remains strong. After their worst year since the global financial crisis, stocks will likely see some recovery, but the recession threat will keep gains in check. Keep an eye on inflation. It could play spoiler if prices remain stubbornly high, forcing the central bank to keep raising rates for longer and by more than expected upending the outlook for all assets.